Hello, I'm the pro wrestling VTuber dedicated to love and justice, Kit Saberfang, and today I'll be showing you how to sign up for the Wrestle Universe streaming service. I'd mentioned in a previous video, and as time marched on, I came to realize that Tokyo Joshi Pro had become my favorite wrestling promotion on the planet. And so I'd like to show you how you can watch TJPW as well, along with the other promotions available on the service. We'll go over how to register an account, its monthly costs in your local currency, troubleshooting tips, available apps, and what's available on the service. To do this, you'll simply need a valid email address and a credit card or PayPal account. So with that in mind, let's get to it. Step one is opening your web browser of choice and head over to wrestle-universe.com slash en. Depending on your location, simply going to wrestle-universe.com should open the English version of the site by default. Wrestle Universe is the official streaming service of Cyberfight, parent company to their four wrestling promotions, DDT Pro, Pro Wrestling Noah, Tokyo Joshi Pro, and Ganbare. You'll find extensive archives for all of these promotions on the service, regular live streams that are included with your subscription, along with various different ways to discover content, which we'll go over soon. Step two is registering an account. Start by clicking Login in the top right corner, and on the next page, select New Registration. Input the email address you'd like associated with your account, along with a secure password. You'll then be asked to confirm your email by inputting the verification code sent to your address. Step three is submitting your credit card information to begin the subscription service. A monthly subscription to Wrestle Universe costs 900 yen per month, and if you're outside of Japan, that falls subjected to current exchange rates. As of recording, this is the cost of 900 yen in some of the most common currencies around the world. And if yours isn't listed here, I'll have a direct link to a currency calculator in the description below. This is of course a constantly fluctuating number, but we can see that right now, a 900 yen Wrestle Universe subscription costs about $6 US, 5.5 euros, 5 pounds, so on and so forth. If everything went smoothly, then congratulations, you should now have an active Wrestle Universe subscription. However, if you ran into problems with payment processing, such as a valid credit card being denied, check your text messages or emails for any kind of fraud notice from your bank or credit card company. If you don't regularly make many overseas purchases, trying to purchase a Wrestle Universe subscription can definitely trigger a fraud notice. If you don't receive a notice and are still being declined, you may want to call your bank or credit card company to see if it's being blocked anyway. You could also try a different credit card if you have one on hand, as overseas transactions can be a bit finicky in this way. Okay, now that you have an active subscription, what do you watch and how do you do it? And what if you want to watch it on your TV? You've got a few options there, so let's go over what's available and what to check out first. As I mentioned earlier, Wrestle Universe is home to four promotions. Pro Wrestling Noah is the promotion founded by one of the legendary four pillars of All Japan Pro Wrestling, the late great Mitsuhara Misawa, who led a mass exodus of talent from AJPW following the passing of its founder, Giant Baba. It's definitely the most serious of the Cyberfight promotions and has been enjoying a resurgence of interest following the incredible retirement tour of Keiji Muto. Next is DDT Pro, which stands for Dramatic Dream Team Wrestling. The rest of the promotions on the Wrestle Universe service tend to spin out of the DDT style of offering a more, mm, let's say, sports entertainment approach, as opposed to Noah's more hard-nosed King's Road style. This is the promotion that the likes of Kenny Omega and Kota Ibushi really cut their teeth and made a name for themselves, competing in some of the most outlandish events wrestling has seen to date, a tradition that very much continues to this day. Tokyo Joshi Pro Wrestling, or TJPW for short, is the women's wrestling-focused promotion on the service. TJPW is similar to DDT in a lot of ways, with surreal and comedic elements sprinkled throughout the card, giving way to hard-hitting contests towards the top. Finally, there's Gambare Pro Wrestling, a more traditional mixed-gender promotion with a focus on new and developing talent, along with a host of international guests. You'll also see Gambare talent regularly blending in with DDT and TJPW talent. So what do you watch first? Let's hop into Tokyo Joshi Pro and see what's available. For each promotion, you'll find the following categories. The upcoming schedule of live streams, an archive of the latest streams, big matches, which is typically their biggest and most important events, the current roster, which leads to the latest shows they've appeared in, and an on-demand section for shows that weren't streamed live along with bonus content. If you're not sure what to watch first, my suggestion would be to visit the page for the promotion that you're most interested in and check out their big matches section. These are typically their pay-per-view style events and represent the biggest shows the promotion has to offer, a perfect jumping off point to get your feet wet. 
And if there's a specific talent that lured you into Wrestle Universe in the first place, you could also jump straight to their roster page and start exploring their history of matches. Okay, now let's talk viewing options. If you're looking to watch Wrestle Universe away from your PC, they do have an official app for both iOS and Android that supports AirPlay. And if you'd like to download that now, I have the QR codes right here on the screen. If you're like me and have something like an Amazon Fire that doesn't support the Android app, you can use the Amazon web browser or media stick equivalent to go directly to wrestle-universe.com from there. It's not ideal, but in my experience, it holds up pretty well and the quality is still great. All right, now that you're signed up and a certified Wrestle Universe expert, get out there and watch some wrestling. I hope this helps some of y'all out and I look forward to you discovering the joy of Raku's train of the day. See you next time.